A deck is a deck is a deck, right? Well, think again. You may have heard of the void con system. In the next few minutes, you will see how the system works and what makes it unique. It works like this. When you reach deck height, all materials are delivered on site. This includes galvanized steel profiles, closures and stiffener plates. Closures and stiffener plates are fitted into the profiles to keep them rigid during concrete casting and to stop the concrete from flowing into the void area. These are fitted with stitching screws. In the same way, the other stiffeners are fitted to all the profiles. Stiffeners are fitted 1.5 meters apart. Now we can start building the deck. The first profile is placed in position. The next profile is then brought into position and clips into the first one. In the same way, all the other profiles are clipped into position. Next for the support structure. Bearers with props are positioned at 2 meter centers to support the deck. Next, the mesh goes on. Alternatively, fiber reinforced concrete can be used. On a slab width of around 4 to 5 meters, there is normally no reinforcing required. For wider slabs and higher load bearing requirements, reinforcement is specified according to engineering tables. Next, the concrete gets poured. It gets mechanically vibrated and gets leveled. It cures and after two weeks the support system comes out and the side shutters come off. Let's take a closer look at the system. The concrete takes the shape of the profiles. The concrete steel combination provides the strength and stability. While the concrete is strong on compression, steel is strong on tension. The profiles and the concrete form an indestructible bond and provides exceptional composite action. Once the deck has set, the stiffness can be removed as they are no longer required. This unique T-beam design gives the product exceptional strength. As a result, there are voids in the deck, resulting in a concrete saving of around 40 to 60 percent compared to a conventional deck. To fit a ceiling is quite easy. First, wood or steel brand ring are installed. Conduits, plumbing pipes and down lighters can now easily be fitted into the voids. And finally, ceiling boards are fitted. Another option is to leave the profiles open and then paint them. How does the system look in real life? Let's take a look. Because the void con system is so simple to install, there is no specialized labor required. This makes it possible to recruit and train people from the local community, thereby providing employment and skills transfer. Voidcon is the only decking company with national representation. If you are planning a project, you contact our 0861 number. Our regional office will then make an appointment. From that point until the deck is complete, our local office remains at your service. We liaise closely with all parties during the preparation stage. If required, we will appoint the engineer and liaise with the engineer to get the deck plan finalized. If required, we will also appoint the subcontractor to install the deck. On the agreed date, we ensure that all materials are delivered on site and we ensure that the job is completed to specification. If required, we arrange the inspection and we ensure that the certificate is issued. Our clients are very enthusiastic about this product for several reasons. Firstly, it's a lightweight system, so it's easier to install than any other system. Compared to a conventional suspended slab, there's much less propping required. And because it's such a simple system, the props are much quicker to install. But how does the cost compare against a conventional system? The profiles are an additional cost component in the void con system. However, this weighs less than the additional cost factors on the conventional system. The rental cost of propping is much lower because you use much less and the turnaround time is much quicker. 
you also get a substantial saving on reinforcing. On a 4 meter span, no reinforcement is required for the void con deck. Even on larger lengths, the reinforcing is substantially less than a conventional deck. The concrete usage is 40 to 60 percent less, as indicated earlier. In total, the void con system gives you a cost saving of roughly 30 percent. Quick to install, light and strong, cost effective. The Voidcon system is in a class of its own. Voidcon is also much more friendly to the environment compared to the conventional deck. Let's look at the big picture first. It's a well-known fact that our planet is in a crisis. Millions of tons of carbon dioxide are being pumped into the air. This forms a ceiling and heat from the sun gets trapped under the ceiling. The earth warms up and the ice caps start melting. Scientists warn us that unless we take action now, the ice caps will continue to melt and the Earth's weather system will soon become very unstable. Coastal cities will be flooded and natural disasters will start occurring on a regular basis. Certain products are particularly harmful to the environment because a lot of carbon dioxide is generated when they are produced. Unfortunately, this is a problem with concrete and steel which are the two main ingredients in any deck. The challenge is therefore to use as little steel and concrete in a deck as possible, whilst still achieving the required strength and stability. This is the Voidcon deck. This is a conventional deck. Let's look at one square meter of each. The design of the Voidcon deck has been optimized to offer the required strength and stability, although it contains 40 to 60% less concrete than the conventional deck. It also contains substantially less steel. In the Voidcon deck, the steel is in the form of the profile plate. In the conventional deck, it's in the form of reinforcing steel. The Voidcon profile plate is less than a millimeter thick, whereas the reinforcing bars on the conventional deck are between 12 and 16 millimeters thick. As a result, the Voidcon deck contains 2.5 times less steel than the conventional deck. Because of its low steel and concrete content, the amount of carbon dioxide being generated in the production of the Voidcon deck has been minimized. But to put it into perspective, for one square meter, it still amounts to 61 kilograms going up into the Earth's atmosphere. In the case of one square meter of the conventional deck, however, it amounts to a staggering 137 kilograms. Voidcon is the logical choice for strength, ease of installation and cost. From an environmental point of view, it is also the responsible choice.